Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Ali A and today new gameplay of Mega Pokemon within Pokemon X and Y was released and I've got that here for you guys here on my channel. Now I'm secretly a big Pokemon fanboy and I've been keeping up to date with this X and Y information but if you guys haven't I'll be giving you guys all the latest information after the trailer and let me know if you'd like to see Pokemon X and Y here on this channel when it launches later this year. October the 12th worldwide is the release date but enjoy the trailer, check out the new Mega Pokemon Come on, and I'll be back in a minute. So that was our very first look at how Mega Pokemon will work within Pokemon X and Y. I'm going to give an in-depth explanation as to how these Mega Pokemon work and how you can get them in-game. And then after that I'm going to go back to the basics, explain a little bit more about what Pokemon X and Y is, just in case you're watching this video and you have absolutely no idea and you're out of the loop but you want to know more. So Mega Pokemon aren't evolutions and they aren't forms. These Mega Pokemon are only obtained and are only usable within battle. They need to be holding the correct Mega Stone for that Pokemon. And once they're holding it, when you go into battle, they'll turn into their Mega Pokemon. And then they'll stay like that throughout the battle until the battle ends when they'll turn back to the normal Pokemon. When they change into their Mega Pokemon, sometimes they'll change abilities, stats, and sometimes even types and, of course, their appearance. So that's all we know so far about the Mega Pokemon. The confirmed Mega Pokemon so far are Mega Mewtwo, Mega Blaziken, Mega Lucario, Mega Morwell, Mega Absol and Mega Amphros which is pretty damn awesome. But that's all we know so far, if you guys want to see more Pokemon X and Y news or anything Pokemon related here on my channel let me know in the comment section down below but now it's time to go back and fill you guys in with any information you may have missed. So for those of you guys that don't know, you can see on screen here the box art for Pokemon X and Y. It's coming out, as we now know, on October the 12th, 2013, just on the 3DS. It's the first full Pokemon 3D game within the main series of Pokemon, which is awesome. And there are a load of new Pokemon that we know of already before release. You can see a few of them on screen here. They've introduced a new type called Fairy type, which is super effective against Dragon. You can see a few Fairy Pokemon on screen here and lots of new things have been introduced with this game they're mixing up a lot which is really awesome to see for those of you guys that have played any of the recent Pokemon games you know they've pretty much been the same since the very beginning really but this is set to change a lot of things within the background here you can see some of the previous trailers which have been released for Pokemon X and Y just in case you've missed them here on screen now you can see the world map for Pokemon X and Y which looks pretty damn awesome but there we go guys that's pretty much all of the basics for Pokemon X and Y I've always wanted to do a Pokemon video on YouTube and now that I have my second channel I can do so I really hope you guys have enjoyed this and found it at least informative in some way. If you guys have enjoyed give it a thumbs up and let me know if you still play Pokemon or if you used to be a big Pokemon fan when you were younger in the comment section down below. But thank you so much for watching guys make sure you haven't missed out any of my recent videos including me playing Minecraft and Mario Kart and I'll see you guys on my next video. Cheers.